All right, everyone. So I got myself a pair of shoes. Got myself a pair of shoes from 2018 Skater of the Year. And if you don't know who that is, well, I suggest you go watch the video Blessed, Supreme Blessed. It's a skate video from Supreme. And the last part is Tyshawn Jones. And Tyshawn Jones just got a shoe. Let's check it out. Tyshawn's shoe. Oh, damn, what the heck? Daddy's. What the fuck? Damn. Look at that. Look at that. This looks fire. Let's feel it out. Alright. So, just by feeling it, the thing that I already like is this. It feels like the cushion around the ankle and your Achilles. Wow. It's like, if I could show how it looks in there, like, it goes in, like, to this, this deep. So, it feels like once I put my foot in there, it's going to be really well supported. This feels... This looks and feels very strong. The grip on this, I think heel flips are gonna be lit with these shoes. Oh shit. Wow. Just like I was saying, right here, I feel my ankle, like right here, like where your, the, the ball of your ankle is. It feels really protected and cushioned. feels like I need to break it in like skate a few while like I literally feel like I just leveled up like I upgraded you know like in video games whenever you're, you're able to buy uh, uh, your new gear or whatever this is how it feels I feel like I just upgraded to a new set of gear like what the fuck like this is feeling good let's do the let's do the kickflip test let's, let's, let's do this all right first kickflip of the day too All right, that kickflip was horrible because I was sitting down and I just had to get up. I'm gonna be warming up with these shoes. Right now what it feels like, it just feels like I have to skate around in them, maybe walk like a few uh, seconds or minutes. But right now it feels really good on my foot. I got these in size eight and a half. Usually my shoes are size nine, but I got them in eight and a half because I remember from previous Adidas shoes, that size nine felt a little too big. So I just decided to be a little safe and get 8.5 just to make sure that these were a good fit and didn't fly off. All right, so I'm gonna skate around and I'm gonna talk about these shoes after the sesh. So let's do that. I just started warming up with Back360. Some of the Back 3s didn't feel comfortable. I did it like probably like 10 times or more. Then I started doing backside flip. Backside flip, this is where I started knowing like, okay, this shoe really has to kick in because it's not board feel. Like I don't feel my board. Like, I don't know if you can see, but I'm already starting to, starting to show that I've been skating it. So I had to do three backside flips just or like even like one more than three backside flips just to feel comfortable because I didn't like the way they I did them and 
I just knew that, okay, it's just flicking and like kind of mobbing. And it's not how it usually feels. Usually when I do a backside flip, it like just jumps straight to my feet. Like, like let's say I do the backside flip and it just like feels like it just launches up to my feet like this. Uh, then I started doing tray flip and it also did the same thing like the backside flip. It, it just feels like uh, the shoe is thick and I can't feel the, the board. So the board feel isn't there right now. I definitely need to kick these in. I'm gonna see how it feels to jump down the six there and if I feel any impact. But as far as I know right now, just like within a 15 minute sesh and jumping into a pyramid like straight on, like going into these tricks, I could already feel the difference between this shoe not being kicked in and a different shoe that's kicked in. So that, and this is just my first session with these shoes. So let's see how it skates off the six there and give it some judgment right now afterwards. So I just got done skating the stairs and the shoes are really stiff like I'm not lying like these shoes are really stiff it took me a while to even heel flip it I had to you know what I took a sketchy one it's all right like I'm just testing the shoes out I wasn't gonna die just to get a clean one these shoes are still stiff but they feel really good jumping down it I didn't have no problem right now like I, I jumped down the heel flip for a good amount of times uh, the front 360 was taking a little longer than what I usually do. Like, usually I get it like second try. This was like five, ten tries. It, I don't know. But so far, these shoes are really good. I am very curious how they're going to feel when they're broken in. And uh, I like the color. Baby scratch. If anyone wants to know any other questions for the full review, leave your questions below so I could when I make the full review for this shoe, I could let you know what I experienced wearing them, what deteriorated faster, what was uncomfortable about it, and how long did it take to actually break in. Because this is just day one, I'm gonna continue to skate. I just wanted to film uh, this short first break in of the shoe to let everyone know how the, the my first initial uh, response is to the shoe. So thank you everyone for watching this shoe. Um, first look and I'll definitely let you all know how it comes in, comes through at the end of like two weeks and I'm excited to wear these. It's been like a few months since I had uh, Adidas so I'm hyped. Thank you everyone for watching. Like, subscribe and let me know what your questions are for these shoes. Like what do you want me to uh, think, like review or uh, really focus on for the full video. Uh, see you later in the next video. Sign out until next time. Yeah.